Now look, if you've ever watched an episode of Nick Cannon's Wildin' Out, then you have seen my girl Justina Valentine killing it on stage. In this holiday season, Justina wanted us to know that she's about more than just rapping at a drop of a dime. She's an actress, honey, okay? <laughs> and she puts it all on display this Wednesday, December 21st on VH1 in her original Christmas movie called Forget about Christmas, okay? It's about her Italian family. <laughs> she told me all about it, so you gotta check it out. Justina, thank you so much for being here. Yes, Ashley, thank you so much for having me. Always great to see you. I appreciate you taking the time. Oh, anytime, girl. Anytime you wanna come on this show, you got a spot, you got a spot guaranteed. <laughs> Yes, I'm, listen, I'm trying to come see you in person at the studio, but we'll we'll work that out. Yeah, we'll 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 get it together. <laughs> so let's talk about this new movie that you got out. I'm gonna let you pronounce the name because I keep doing it to myself and I'm like, I don't know if I'm saying it right. And I once people you know, see the spelling, they'll they'll get it. Yes, we're gonna get it. So it's forget about Christmas. Forget about it. All right, I love it. Yeah, so it's a play on the term forget about it. But Christmas is the it. So forget about Christmas. I love it. So how did this this movie come to be? Yeah, so, okay, here's the thing, actually. A lot of people know me for my rapping skills, my freestyle ability, my off the top. They call me the wild style queen, this, that, and the third. But what they don't know is I, I really have, like, a real wacky, goofy side to me, and I like to play characters. So in this movie, I'm getting my Eddie Murphy on. All right, I'm channeling Tyler Perry and I'm playing six different characters, Ashley. And I'm really excited for the world to, to see that side of me peel this layer back because it's something they've never seen before. So um, the movie started with, we had this big dinner scene where I'm basically playing my entire family. <laughs> and we wanted to do it as like a skit for YouTube uh, a couple years back, but time got away from us and we didn't want to do it if we didn't do it correct. We're going to come correct or not at all. You feel me? So right. when that didn't happen, um, we were just like, well, let's build out a whole movie around this scene. And I'm very blessed to have a, a real uh, healthy Rolodex of amazingly talented celebrity friends. So we built out the story around this scene, called all my friends. And I have to tell you, Ashley, not one person that I called and asked to come in the movie didn't make it through, which is incredible because, you know, these people are booked and busy. Let's start with Nick Cannon. Right? Booked. I I mean, he got I, he got a whole bunch of kids to take care of and still squeezed you in. <laughs> kids, jobs, you know, hosting. I mean, mogul, businesses. It's amazing. Um, The fact that Nick came through for me, meant so much because I know how busy he is. And, um, you know, the, the fact that he squeezed me in just means everything. You know, Nick is more than a boss. He's a mentor. He's a friend. He's like a big brother. So I just appreciated that so much. But then let's talk about DC Young Fly. Right. My, my bro, super busy, conceited. Um, Fetty Wap, Sway, Teresa Judice, Renee Graziano, Vincent Pastore, Tonio Skits. Perez um, Hilton. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Perez Hill, yes. I mean, a laundry list of super celebrities that are so talented at what they do. I mean, the best in their field. And they all came through, believed in me, believed in the vision. And that was the most incredible part of this whole process, Ashley, was honestly having my friends come through and believe in me and just be a part of this. I love it. And I, I had a chance to see the movie. It is hilarious. Yes, <laughs> and you can tell you. that everyone within this uh, this movie, I felt like there was a genuine connection between you and them. So I could tell that you guys are our friends. You have a connection off screen because it was just so natural. So natural. And some of literally the funniest and best moments of the movie are freestyle. In yeah. The not in the script, just <laughs> us on set rapping. There's parts where I was just rapping, can see was just rapping that we just left in because we're like, oh, that's fire. Um, there right. are jokes that, and, and just like a whole run of conversation that we did not have written out, but you put all these talented people in the room and that's what's gonna happen, especially that's what we're all known for while and out, we do improv. So that was where some of the most magical moments happen. And, um, Man, I think when the world sees it, it's, it's going to be a Christmas uh, season that they'll never be able to forget about. We cannot wait to see Forget About Christmas. Hey. I love it. <laughs> I know you, Thank you so, 
You yes, thank you so I much for being to here. To, to Christmas dinner. Thank yes. you so much for having me, love. I hope you have an amazing Christmas. God bless you and yours. And thank you so much for taking the time. Thank you. Anytime, anytime. Ciao.